Uh, time for GBD's Wombat's Fortnightly News. It's a big Fortnite week. There's a reason why I haven't watched much. The new season came out on Sunday. The new Fortnite season came out on Sunday. It's called Fortnite Paradise. <sighs> There, there is Chrome taking over the island. <sighs> and it's pretty cool. See with the Chrome and the, and the people on the island. Awesome. Mm -hmm. What else we got in GBD's Wombat's Fortnightly News? There's a new season of Fortnite. Spider-Gwen. Nice. We talked about this last week. Yep. You confirmed that she has a gun. Yeah, Spider-Gwen does have a gun. But she's back. Anyway, let's talk about the big news is that we finally saw the final footage of the new <laughs> Grand Theft Auto. We know exactly what it's going to look like upon release. And boy, are we all disappointed that it looks like hard driving on the Sega Genesis. I did not participate in any of that fucking nonsense. I All I ever saw of it, because I didn't, I didn't really want to care to look i saw some screen grabs because it was in my twitter feed i don't care about it. any of that it's just everybody's comments about it like who cares like it's not who cares about your comments on a game that's going to come out in fucking what three years or something two years yeah. it's like <coughs> it, it, yeah it's just i mean a lot of i'm sure a lot of uh websites got plenty of views out of it but it's just like oh my god who cares the the conversation who just who cares their stock went down quite a bit after that leak too, because people are like, "Oh my god!" But that's just temporary. It's just temporary. It's, like, I know it's meaningless. It's like a good it's, time to buy then. Sure, they're, this game's going to sell 150 copy million copies make. exactly <laughs> for for the next 15 to 20 years. Right, they got to tighten up those graphics on level three. <laughs> right, <laughs> are those guys available? I think they are probably. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, I mean, they can't believe they get to do it for a living. So, right, <laughs> right. I can't believe that people who get to do that, you get to talk about that leak for a living, or just like <laughs> on Twitter. It was just like, oh, I couldn't. The dialogue was killing me. It was frightening. I mean, because they were like people, were like I know video games, and graphics are the first thing to get done. I saw that. I saw that comment. No, I think that was a, wasn't that a joke? Somebody was. No, someone was serious. And then, like all the other companies, like showing their games, like when they when they were in development, like, oh my god, it's like you're explaining to people who think the Earth is flat that it's round. Like, what? To, why even wasting your time? Just ignore, ignore it. Like, some people just don't get it and are gonna. It's like what I was talking about with like with the table tennis. Like, you got everybody's opinion about something they don't know anything about. Like, who cares? Just let them. You know, just don't even listen to them. Anyway, it was funny though. <laughs> It was funny that like people thought that was going to matter in anything. Like the games, like Shift said, the game's going to come out. It's going to sell all the copies and forever, <laughs> all the copies forever. Uh, what else we got? Speaking of of leaking things, so there was a YouTuber whose name I don't know off the top of my head. Uh, Dan, Dan Allen, Allen Gaming. Yes, Dan. Uh, he was revealed to be the real insider, which is a leaker account. Uh, he apparently was also just like a regular non-leaker account guy, but he had been breaking the end, his own NDAs to, uh, give this breaking NDAs to leak this information. Basically PR companies were emailing him saying you're under NDA. Don't spill this video game news until this date. And then he would go into his alt account and be like, ah, oh, I found out from a reliable source. Did you see how he got busted? He didn't he like let it slip by accident on his YouTube channel or something? No, worse. The worst po uh, the worst possible way you can get busted. It's the way so many people get busted, Chip. You know? uh, he replied <laughs> back with his actual account to something yes. that was uh, exactly supposed to do his alt account. Exactly, exactly. And it's like it's, it's like career ending. I feel. Yeah, pretty much. I, if he doesn't get you know sued. I don't, I don't know that he's going to get sued. I saw a lot of people talking about that on Twitter. It's I mean, like, he could get sued. Of course, the potential is there, but like, it's not going to look great for for Ubisoft to do it. Like, is there, were there really like damages caused there? Like, I don't know. It's yeah, it's it's ridiculous. Though. The whole thing is ridiculous. And it, he, I guess he had a uh, he filmed a, uh, an apology video. I haven't seen well, it. Well, you have to. 
He's and he's a YouTuber, so he's he should have the chair. <laughs> he's got a special room ready to go. Mm-hmm. He's got like the fireman's pole, just goes right down, lands right, right in the chair. Right down to the apology room yep. in the apology chair. Pushes the button. He's got like a macro set on his Steam Deck mm-hmm. and a Stream Deck, and just like puts everything up. Yeah, he has his apology face ready to go. Yes, a lot of drama, a lot of drama. Uh, what else hey, we got? Guys. Guys, I'm really sorry. I'm not. This is not who I am. This is not what I do. It's not who I am. I, I didn't mean to hurt anybody. Right. I was just lonely. I'm just a sad person. Don't you feel? Mm-hmm. Wait, now this is getting depressing. Sorry. Uh, what else? Uh, did you hear they're making a game based on Marvel's most popular character? Spider-Man? No. I said most popular character. The numero uno head honcho. Captain America. The big cheese note number one. The character Hawkeye. when I say Marvel. When I say Marvel, everyone goes, oh, I know Marvel. They have blank. Robert Downey Jr. That is correct. The Iron Man. Oh, I thought they were making a Robert Downey Jr. game. They are. They're making Robert Downey Jr. the game. You have to go from backyard to backyard. And if you get too drunk and pass out in a backyard... The game's over. Or you win. Or you win. Uh, Until someone calls the cops. So it's the same so this, studio this that's is... making, that, that made uh, Guardians? No, this is the Dead Space studio, right? People that made Dead Space? Oh. Yeah, so people, mm-hmm. Oh. Like, no no longer that studio, right? Like, but those uh, people. Those people, yeah. right? I don't, Motive Studio? Do they have maybe? flying experience. It sounds like they don't have flying experience. They, they have a person in a suit experience right like i mean it's not (laughs) terrible experience but that's ground-based did you hear that they they didn't want to make an iron man game because they felt like he was too heavy to fly conceptually and people wouldn't buy it don't they have flying experience though aren't they're the people who made the uh the star wars yes the the flying star wars game the flying squad yeah oh but that's spaceship flying experience that's different you well, just, you got to meld the two together. You, get you still put the wings on the spaceship, and then you, you have a guy. Right. It's still think, a man in a can. I think they can make this work. Okay. I, sure. I, like, I could shoot things with Iron Man. The I VR think there's one a lot of good. potential for an Iron Man game. I think they, you know, if, if done right, I think you need to have... Are you worried about the EA aspect of this? I don't know. I mean, it's not like they've, their track record as of late hasn't been so terrible. They made that uh, Jedi Fallen Order game. That was really good. Was it? Uh, yeah. Mm. Yeah. That single player Star Wars so, game. Okay. I like that a lot. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I mean, yes, they made Anthem and that was hot garbage, but wasn't that like five years ago at this point? How long ago was that? That was basically Iron Man. Yeah. Shouldn't they just turn uh, that into Iron Man? I feel like they could save a lot of money. I, I feel like this is going to be a tough one for them because... It's going to get compared to the Spider-Man game. It will get compared to the Spider-Man games, but this will be multi-platform. And not so as good. They'll, they'll have PlayStation support for it, so it's not like PlayStation's going to be like, don't buy Spider-Man, don't buy this, buy Spider-Man. So, oh, there's know. nobody that's buying the Iron Man game that didn't already buy Spider-Man. That's what I mean. It, they're complementary <laughs> products. So <laughs> One way. You know, Only one way. Yeah. A one-way complementary. They well, have so Spider-Man the, the flying by on the, on the cover. He's in the background of the Iron Man <laughs> those, uh, cover. Those, like the like this first Spider-Man movie poster, which has Iron Man really small in the back. Um, yeah, yes, those Spider-Man video games are very, very good, and it's excellent. Maybe the best of a generation. So yes, it is definitely a uh, a high bar to, to cross. There hasn't been another single player marvel based game based on one character since spider-man right that's that, that's quite the so <laughs> well you know what i mean so we're, we're just ignoring guardians because there were other people that were because there were other people yes on the screen that you said go do stuff and, with, yes. and not enough people bought it even though you played the same character the entire time well you play, yeah i guess technically you only play a star lord in that one that's a good game too though it's an excellent game i just i know how you call it I was qualified from this because I don't because that game doesn't that game is really like a walking movie. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's like a how walking. do we know that this isn't? Well, they're they're calling it a single player action game, so I don't know. I guess we'll find out. That's what I'm saying. I, if they're trying to make a game like Spider Man, 
I hope they are. I don't want them to go to the Guardians round, even though I really like Guardians. Can you make an Iron Man game like Spider Man though? You want op- open world Iron Man just going around and, like saving cats out of trees? I don't know. I don't know if doing? it'll be open world. I think it'll be not open world. I don't know. Not open Linear. world. Lin- Lin- maybe maybe a little of both. Maybe like a hub world that you could kind of maybe save a cat from a tree in, but then once you get to the the hit X He's too to drunk mission, to be doing that. He's not going to be saving goes, cats for trees. He's going to be out partying. Or maybe it's more like that Star Wars game where you're going from a smaller open world section to a smaller open world section with like, I don't know, a helicarrier in between not a helicarrier because I've done that. I don't know. Train. I'm not making the game. A crane? Train, train. Like a oh, train, like a really yeah. nice train. Yeah, yeah. Tony Stark's like, oh my god, I gotta get out of the Middle East. I gotta get back to uh to Europe. Oh, I'll, I'll just take this train. My train. And, oh, I it's gotta get train. back to my house in San Francisco. I'll just take the train from Europe to San Francisco. It turns into a jet also. Do you think War Machine will be in the game as a playable character? Maybe would it, would it disqualify it? If it I don't was. know. <laughs> yes, it would disqualify it. Uh, what there else hasn't we... really been the, like a marquee, because Avengers kind of was sort of a bust, right? If they Not had focused sorta. that game. Big time. It was a big what time was? bust. It was a big time was... bust. Not sort yeah. of a bust. Like It was a colossal failure, I think. That game was a huge, a huge bomb. A money pit. So, mm-hmm. So who knows? We'll see what EA can do. I think they did a good job with their most recent Star Wars output. Don't expect Spider Man. I think is what Chip is saying. Is that what you're saying? I'd be. I would be. Don't expect the quality. Be surprised if this game is as good as that last Star Wars Jedi game. I think that's a bar that's doable. That's that's my goal. That's my hope. I want this game to be as good as the last Star Wars. What is it? Is it Jedi or, Fallen Order? Yep. Am I saying it right? I was right. Okay. I'm old. I forget things. If this game is as good as that game, I would be pleasantly surprised. I feel like getting like moving Iron Man around is a challenge in a video game. Like to make it fun. Like you're either guy in a heavy suit just kind of walking plodding along. <laughs> Which is not fun. Nobody wants that. Or you're going like a million miles an hour jet jet boosts everywhere. No, because right? he like, can hover. And just like sort of float he, around. He the can, house. but it's not it. It's not fluid. Like I don't know. Eh, he could do. Like it. He you're could either just flying. Sort of... Iron Man's he, either flying or or walking. He doesn't. He doesn't have to lumber while he's walking. I know. As an engineer, you moonwalk. You you think the physics is he should lumber, but he doesn't have to. You could he could have roller walk. skates. He but does. That's he's from, not. That's comic book accurate. Roller skates. His. Yes. His movement isn't as fluid as Spider Man. No. Like Spider Man, you can go like, oh, it's really fun to just like be Spider Man and not do like anything, but like you can spend an hour just going like, oh, I'm swinging around. Like right. getting that fun into an Iron Man. You're just flying. Is, is tough. Right. Unless he's doing cool flips too. He can do like, he does, he has got his moves. His, stylistic I mean, flying that, well, that's way. Just it, is what do they do with the flying? I mean, are they going to make it like combat aces or, you know, is it going to be, or X-Wing versus TIE fighter style? They can do it. Flying and fighting. I believe. Dog fights in space. I believe. Who's he Life fighting? Who's he fighting against here? Well, that's the other question. The... I think the, uh, the villains are important too. Throwing a little Crimson Dynamo, maybe. Jeff Daniels. Oh, yep. Jeff Daniels. Oh, who, was the guy he, who was the guy he fought in the movie? He fought Sam Rockwell? No, in the first movie. Or, or Jeff first, Bridges. Jeff Bridges. Jeff Bridges. Sorry, Bridges. not Jeff Daniels. Bridges, yeah. Jeff Bridges is Iron Monger. Iron Monger, Crimson Dynamo, Titanium Man. I don't know those any of those. the best. Yeah, oh, yeah. all the ones I never heard of. 